Hello Virgo, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your weekly tarot reading for the sign of Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus and it will be from the 8th to the 14th of March 2021. I hope you're well Virgo. Okay, message for Virgo please, Angel Spirits Guides, message for our lovely Virgos. 8th to the 14th of March 2021. What is the overarching energy or message for Virgo, please? Angels, spirits, guides. Okay. Oh, nice. Love the energy. And it is energy. It's an energy shift, the Eight of Wands. Um, something's going to happen here out of the blue. Conversations, communication, opportunity. Oh, lovely energy. It's bringing change. Okay, message for Virgo, please. Angels, spirits, guides, message for Virgo. What do we have for Virgo? Oh, nice. I mean, I love the energy with dreaming because it feels like it's something you've been hoping for or, yeah. Very nice energy, Virgo. Okay. Message for Virgo, please. Angel Spirits Guides, message for Virgo. Thank you. Thank you. If you believe. You know, Virgo, I mean, uh, the energies are kind of sinking in the sense that this is a symbol of, it looks very much like the symbol of Metatron, Archangel Metatron who is the archangel who helped with creation of the world. So there's definitely what you've been creating, something to do with what you've been dreaming of. There's some kind of real positive, swift shift, movement happening. Can be linked to travel as well. Let's pull some cards, see what we get. Okay, message for Virgo. Message for Virgo, please. Angel Spirits Guides. For me, it can also be distance or online technology with the meaning of that card. Okay, message for Virgo, please. Let's clarify. Go deeper into the message as well. Thank you. Once we've pulled the top three cards, what do we have for Virgo, please? Message for Virgo for the week. 8th to the 14th of March 2021. Wow, Virgo, Page of Wands. It's in your challenge position. Ace of Cups is advice from Spirit. Future outcome. Oh my goodness, the Knight of Wands. <laughs> I see these ones tying in with this. I do. What do we have for Virgo? Oh. It's interesting I'm pulling the fairy cards. What do we have for Virgo, please? Angel Spirits Guides, message for Virgo. Message for Virgo. Can we clarify the cards on the table? 8th to the 14th of March 2021, please, Angel Spirits Guides for our lovely Virgos, thank you. Starting with this page of wands. Ten of Cups and Seven of Wands. And the Three of Pentacles. Okay, Ace of Cups is clarified with the King of Swords, Card of Aquarius, Knight of <laughs> Ones is the Wheel of Fortune. Wow, oh my goodness, we have the Ace of Pentacles, Virgo.
something that you have been working towards um hoping would happen i mean there's definitely some positive shift i'm definitely getting some kind of conversation communication here virgo it feels very very beautiful indeed dreaming if you believe Page of Wands is good news. In the challenge position, it's almost kind of like not quite happening yet. Um, and that's what it's almost like news that you've been waiting for, waiting on, and then bam, the good news is coming. That's what I'm feeling. The conversation that's going to bring all the change in the world is coming. Yeah, because we have the Ten of Cups, Seven of Wands and the Three of Pentacles in the challenge position. I mean, the Seven of Wands is an energy of defending, standing up for what you know to be right, standing up for your own beliefs, standing up for what you know to be true, defending something. And it feels, or protecting, I mean, it can be an energy of wanting to protect and it feels it's to do with this Ten of Cups. This Seven of Wands is over the Ten of Cups. The Ten of Cups is uh, a blissful relationship. And then we have this Three of Pentacles, which can be the beginnings of success. Can be in terms of money, career. Can also be in terms of... You might be challenged in moving home as well. I mean, it feels either to do with money and career or moving home. If, it definitely feels for some of you that there is an energy of persevere, keep going, because for some of you there is an opportunity or something coming your way that is going to bring the beginnings of either the beginnings of success or maybe it can be also about moving home. Again, it feels for some of you either in terms of moving home or money career finances here, but it feels in this energy that you have been wanting to protect. You do, it's almost like you're taking action or you're persevering. It feels like some challenging situation that you've experienced here. It's either in terms of moving home or money and career, it could be both, let's face it. But in this situation, it definitely feels it definitely feels Virgo that you've been waiting on some news to come your way. You've been waiting on the shift, and there is definitely an energy of the clarity, or the clarity is going to come. I mean, that King of Swords can be a, a card of clarity. Uh, you might also be dealing with somebody, a King of Swords, somebody who is a visionary, somebody who is very very clever a strategist visionary um could be in terms of business could be in terms of somebody who's helping you moving home as well i mean it feels that they might be instrumental in bringing this ace of cups the ace of cups can be a card of new happiness i mean at the end of the day the ace of cups is the cup of joy it is the new beginning in terms of emotional rebirth um something that makes you happy It can be linked with creative opportunities. It can be linked with a new level of love or a new level of happiness. It feels like something's coming in that's going to make you happy. Either a person, male or female energy with this King of Swords, is instrumental in bringing this happiness to your door. This could also be you're going to get the clarity, some kind of clarity is coming your way that is bringing some kind of happiness. Things are going to become clear. Um, and it's part of some kind of new vision. So like I said, it's either moving home or can be in terms of the beginnings of new success, maybe new jobs, new business partnership even, or moving relocating. 
it, it definitely feels it can be both like I said it feels like for some of you there is some news that you're waiting on here it's been a bit of a challenging situation here but you're determined to see something through because you can see the success at the end of this I'm going to clarify this ace of cups let's clarify this ace of cups Let's clarify this Ace of Cups. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> it is. It's a significant achievement. The Six of Wands, a victory. Um, a significant achievement. And being recognised. And it feels like this Ten of Cups, people in your life are recognising your achievement. This is definitely an energy of some significant achievement coming your way that's making you feel happy and it's something that you've been persevering on so it definitely feels either somebody is instrumental in bringing this victory about maybe some kind of um could be some kind of consultant or business person in in, in business career or you know somebody who's offering you this opportunity or it can be some advisor helping you move i mean it could be both um, but there's definitely is an energy, the King of Swords is clarity on some kind of big vision or plan that you've been hoping for. And I definitely feel for some of you, there's some, some significant victory coming your way. And that's what Spirit is telling you. Um, significant achievement that you've been working hard to achieve. And it feels that you've been waiting for the news to come. And the Wheel of Fortune is really telling you that things happen when they're meant to happen. They won't be rushed. It's divine timing, orchestration. So, you know, this is good luck, good fortune, but it appears when it's meant to appear. Um, so there may well have been a feeling here, Virgo, of things being beyond your control. Uh, because you, there's been perseverance and you're kind of thinking, oh my goodness, will this ever Ever, will I ever get to the point where I want to get to the victory, the success? And the message is yes, because the Knight of Wands is bringing in the opportunity that brings change. It's some kind of exciting opportunity, the Knight of Wands energy. Um, great trailblazing energy. I mean, you know, there's definitely this energy here, Virgo, of, yeah. The news that you've been waiting for, it could be to do with this opportunity, is finally here. And that is the future outcome for you. And it's opening this new beginning for you in your conscious reality. With the Ace of Pentacles being the gift from the universe, saying things happen when they're meant to happen. And everything happens when it's meant to happen for a reason at the time it's meant to happen. So again, the Ace of Pentacles is the, the, the aces are the pentacles energy is the slowest of all the all the suits but it is the most solid stable secure so a new level of security and abundance coming your way can be in the form of career financial opportunities can be in the form of moving relocating so you might be doing both you might be doing one of those things but i'm definitely feeling for some of you there is change coming Good, good luck, good fortune, the news that you've been waiting for, the shift that you've been hoping for. Uh, it feels like some kind of conversation is quite poignant to that happening this week, Virgo. And it's going to bring all the difference because a new door is opening for you. And it is that golden, the golden opportunity, isn't it? The Ace of, of Pentacles. Um, the beginnings of abundance, the beginnings of something that can be really if you take action towards it, it can really grow in terms of success and stability and security and flourishing. So it's a great, great energy for you for that reason. Feels very beautiful, but I love this. It's just out of the blue. Things start shifting. Yeah, it's interesting because I've got the six and I've got the seven and I've got the eight of wands. So it's a process that you've been going through, this step change. And that's what spirit is recognizing. You have been going through the right steps. You have been taking the right um, initiatives, the right action, um, and it's gonna pay off. And that's what you're being told, yeah. So don't, 
don't give up. This is absolutely, you are creating it. You are taking the right steps and it is going to end in something very beautiful here. Could be some conversation this week. Yeah, could be some conversation this week. We have magical blessings. Whatever you're going through, you're being assisted by magical fairy blessings. The fairies say you can bless others too. Yeah, I definitely get this energy. Because remember, this is the helping hand. This is the helping hand. Love the energy there. But it happens when it's meant to happen. But there is absolutely the shift. Good luck, good fortune, expansion, growth coming your way in the form of this opportunity. I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful week for you all, Virgo, and I will see you next time. Thank you.